Interstate Roofing met a monster in March of 2019. It came in the form of a commercial building in Greenwood Village in need of a new roof. Conquering this 825 square monster was no small feat. And tonight, for their efforts, Interstate Roofing takes home the second place prize in Division 4 of the CRA Awards. The building itself was constructed in 1982 as a post and beam structure. The existing roofing system was a heavy gravel ballast over 60 mil EPDM and a base layer of three inch insulation. When the project began and the gravel ballast was removed, it created a rebound effect on the existing insulation and EPDM, making water management through several snow melts a constant challenge. Furthermore, the company dealt with a zero pitch deck which compounded the standing water issue. Pumps were set up to continuously move thousands of gallons of water off the roof. The new roof is a Versico 20-year Rapid Lock TPO Velcro system, the largest installation of this type in the state of Colorado. This system was installed over a self-adhering vapor barrier, one layer of 2.6-inch ISO insulation, a layer of 1/8-inch EPS taper system, topped by 2.6 inches of Rapid Lock insulation. This system increased the depth of the roof, requiring interstate roofing to construct curb extensions on all of the skylights. The building was 100% occupied by two tenants. There's a 10,000 square foot common area with a cafe serving breakfast and lunch every day with four banks of 58 skylights overhead in the cafe area. Scaffolding was erected in the cafe and the area was wrapped to provide fall protection for crews and overhead protection for tenants. Stair towers were also built on the north and south sides for the crew members to enter and leave the building. Crew members worked at night to install the scaffolding inside and build a pedestrian tunnel through the scaffolding. The perimeter was completely wrapped with parapet clamps and snow fence to contain debris and provide fall protection. Loading material, scheduling cranes, scaffolding and deliveries all required constant management as parking was severely limited. All deliveries and loads were scheduled for the weekend and off hours to eliminate parking congestion. The 24-hour work schedule was supposed to be a three-week process, but one of the heaviest late snowstorm periods in decades hit Denver with over 25 inches of precipitation during the time this job was in progress. The original 90-day construction schedule was pushed to 180 days. But the monster was tamed and for that, Interstate Roofing takes home the second place prize in Division 4. Congratulations, Interstate Roofing.